up guys, Shane Storms with Droid Modern X. Today I'm going to show you guys how to accept the very latest over-the-air update for the LG G3 on Verizon and Keep Root. Now this will get you to Android 5.0.1 Lollipop and you'll be able to maintain Root and you'll be able to keep your custom recovery. Many of you guys that like to flash ROMs and you're on custom recoveries, you know how much of a headache it can be to accept the over-the-air update. Normally you got to flash a stock ROM or a stock image and then you have to clean everything up. Uh, or if you're just stock rooted, you have to restore all your bloatware, uh, get rid of root, and then you can accept the over-the-air update. This is the easiest way to accept the over-the-air update if you have any modifications at all on your phone. I'm going to show you guys how to do this. Let's go ahead and get started. If you want to navigate to this thread, I'll have a link in the description. This is the stock-based Lollipop ROM. Uh, this is the official over-the-air update. This includes root and working bumps. So you'll be able to still use your Team Win Recovery Project, but this is just going to be the easiest way to get to the 5.0.1 Lollipop on the Verizon LG G3. Now what you'll do is you'll scroll down here to where it says um, installation instructions for the official update. That's the one that I decided to use. There's the leak here which came out before the official update. But what you want to do is go ahead and grab this Jasmine ROM version 7.0.zip. Now this is a one and a half gigabyte file so it's going to take a while to download. Once you have that downloaded you're going to grab this Super SU. When all that's completed, we're just going to boot into recovery and flash. So pretty simple. If you're familiar with flashing ROMs, then you'll be able to flash this ROM. Before we flash it real quick, I just want to show you guys that we are on the official version of Android. So we'll go into settings. I'm sorry, the official version of Android Lollipop. We'll go for uh, about phone, software info, and you guys can see uh, that we are currently running Android 5.0.1, build number LRX21Y, and software version is 23C. Now this is the latest and greatest version of Android Lollipop for the Verizon LG G3. And then you guys can see there are a few subtle changes here. Not a whole lot has changed uh, in the way that the LG G3 looks. Their custom skin overlay still looks pretty much the same. Things uh, seem to fly. You guys can see the same old toggles there up top and same app drawer as before as well. We do have these new lollipop style navigation buttons there. Uh, but anyways, we will go ahead and jump into recovery and flash this ROM. So uh, the easiest way to get into recovery on this device is to download and install the Flashify application. So just to be clear here, you will have to already have Team Wind Recovery Project installed on your device. From Flashify, we'll open up our menu and a reboot recovery. And that should boot us into Team Win Recovery Project. There we'll be able to wipe data and flash the ROM in Super SU. Okay, so before you flash the ROM, it's always a good idea to make a backup. Now, this is a full Nandroid backup. I'm currently using Phil's Touch Recovery, but Team Win Recovery Project is actually kind of my favorite. Uh, you can use Phil's Touch, you can use Team Win Recovery Project or Clockwork Mod Recovery. Make sure that you do a full Android backup. That way you can restore to whatever point you're currently at uh, just in case something goes wrong or in case you have some important information that needs to be saved like emails, text messages, phone call logs, etc. So after that you'll just want to scroll down and verify that you do have the correct file. So we're going to install zip. Choose it from SD card. Go down to download is where it should be if you download it directly to your phone. Just verify that you do have on the phone the Jasmine ROM and that updates Super SU version 2. And once you've verified that, we'll go back, wipe data. So go down to uh, wipe and format options. Do a factory reset in Phil's Touch Recovery. You would just do the uh, factory reset in Team Win Recovery Project, which would wipe data cache and do a factory reset there. Once you've completed your data wipe, you'll go down to install zip. Choose it from SD card and just go to your download folder. And then you'll choose the Jasmine ROM first. Go ahead and flash that. It's already flashed on my phone, so I'm not going to do that now. And then once that's finished, you'll immediately go ahead and, uh, before booting into Android, you'll go ahead and flash the Super SU. So when all that's finished, just reboot the device and you should be greeted with Android Lollipop 5.0.1. So guys, this has been the easiest way to update to the latest official over-the-air update for the Verizon LG G3. 
you like this video, be sure to give it a big thumbs up. Subscribe to this channel for more content like this in the future. You can find more of me at DroidModerX.com. Follow me on Twitter at DroidModerX. Thanks, guys, for watching. Be blessed. I'll see you in the next one.